Uh, so, um, you know that sexy 10-speed bicycle that I really want to ride? <laughs> I'm not aware. Her name is Ann Coulter. <laughs> Oh, man. All anyway, right. let's buckle down for this one. Okay. Put your bicycle uh, helmets on. <laughs> anyway, Ann Coulter recently did some speeches. And, of course, there are um, some SJWs, social justice warriors, and Antifa types, you know, that come out and call her a Nazi and a racist. You know how it goes. Um, so I was skimming the news stories, and I saw this, uh, those Ann Coulter headlines, and I started thinking about the Aryan Brotherhood. Mm-hmm. So... My question is, why don't the SJWs and Antifa go after actual racists and Nazis like the Aryan Brotherhood? The answer to that question is very simple. They are scared shitless of the Aryan Brotherhood. Hell, I'm a straight white Christian male, and, I'm, and they scare the bejesus out of me, so I don't blame you. But it turns out, if you live your life as an actual racist with stupid swastikas on your face or whatever, you tend to get into a lot of fights you tend to end up in prison, mostly because America is not a racist country and the average person on the street is willing to stand up against actual racism. So because those actual racists have a lot to, ha, uh, have to fight a lot, they tend to be swole, bald, organized, and travel in large numbers for their own protection because 99% of Americans hate them. But Antifa doesn't go after them. They go after soft targets like Ann Coulter or Ben Shapiro, Jewish guy, by the way, and his wife's a doctor, uh, which makes Antifa hashtag beta bullies. This has got to catch on. Hashtag beta bullies. You aren't going to fuck with the baddest mofo in the schoolyard, are you? No. You pick soft, innocent targets. Worried about gender equality? Why are you never hating on, on Islamic countries where women have one outfit and are treated like house pets? Speaking of Islamic countries, talk about homophobic. They throw gays and trans off of buildings. Why aren't you fighting against them? Because you're terrified of Islamic radicalism. radicalism. That's why. Now, I'm not trying to get myself killed by a Saudi second lieutenant or an obtuse erring asshole. I'm trying to make a point. The impulse to fight evil is a good one. But your aim must be true with your righteous fury. Don't push around the skinny blonde girl because uh, a racist is in your peripheral vision. Don't beat up the violin playing Jewish kid because anti-Semites exist. That's ex- insane and cowardly. There is evil in this world, but keep your aim true. Fight it as intelligently as you can. And violence can and should always be avoided. House Baratheon. Ours is the Fury.